What's up, YouTube? It's your boy C Blends back in the building. And today, man, we got my boy Jamario. Gonna get him right. It's kind of looking more like this, and we're gonna get into it. So, right now, I got my first, my foreguard on. I'm really just going overhead, making sure everything is all the same length, and just going over multiple times. That's all I'm really doing. So, 30 hertz straight up. So I got the ball line in. I'm just setting it in. It's kind of like a, a mid-low taper, really. Um, I have my no guard. I'm making sure everything is uh, same length with the half an inch guideline. I'm just going over multiple times. As you see, I have it halfway. I'm just knocking out the line, starting my process of fading. Now the next step, uh, I got my one guard on, I'm just making sure it's going up, and just like I said, this is still the process I do, I, I, guard, I pretty much fade up, so, now I got the half guard, um, just going up again, the same length I did the one, but this time I'm actually going to get out that second guideline, um, really what I do is I brush and just flick out really using my corners. It's really easy, this taper isn't as hard, but this is just another easy cut. Um, everybody in the shop really does a lot of tapers. I feel like taper can get, can get, can go with the flow of anything. But as y'all can see right now, I have the one and a half guard going up. Um, this time I don't really go up as high because he wants to keep it low. I just make it softening up this, uh, from this four to this one and a half. Now I got the two on. Um, right now I'm just going over it again. This time really I'm just blending out from the two to the to the four really. So that's why I'm kinda of flicking out as you can see when I'm like going higher of this tempo area, so right now I'm just at the end result, I'm just shaving them up, um, making them balder, kind of setting a, a new guideline, but at the same time not. But now I'm in the same process, I'm um, just doing it in the back. What I could say really is uh, you get a wider area, you got more space to work with, so you can make your guidelines more more uh, bigger and more spread out. And as you can see, I, like where his uh, nape area and from his like occipital bone in the back, like it's kind of like a, how do I explain it? It's kind of like more outward, so you have to like work with that. And as you can see, man, I'm just let y'all watch the process. Um, I just want to thank y'all for um, just watching my videos, man. It's pretty cool to see people actually like support and showing love, and that's crazy because I mean, I just want to teach other people, man. It's cool. It's cool to just to be on the YouTube and everything. So. But, um, like I said, this is, I'm gonna let y'all watch the video, but y'all like, sub, and comment, let me know what other videos I want, I mean, I got more videos dropping, right now I'm just taking a day at a time, so let's get right into it. Right now, the techniques that I'm using, um, really, I'm just playing with my lever, opening and closing it. Um, as you can see, I went back to the half guard just to make sure everything is blended in. Right now, I'm using my corners, just flicking out. Um, the only thing I can say really much to fading is just you got to learn the like 
just the process of like your clippers from the inside of your guards like you gotta know every step on what you use and i mean i don't know it just comes in natural hand whenever you start cutting hair and getting behind somebody's head and actually doing it it's actually it's pretty amazing once you understand the the measurements and the reasoning of the guards so i just wanted to give a little tip on that but which i can see it's kind of blending out um it's a lot of detail but just gotta use it and like i said it helps out a lot so Whenever you're done with the tapers and everything, um, it's the same thing on the other side. So I'm gonna just give you like a little fast demonstration on the next side, pretty much. So I'm gonna let y'all, like I said, I'm gonna let y'all keep watching. Uh, I'm trying to find more ways to show y'all how to fade, but at the same time, like I said, I keep it simple. It's easier for me, so. Now, as you can see, I'm just detailing. I pretty much just detailed the taper. Um, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. But I'm going to hit the the next step, which is the lineup. Um, really, I just start on the top of the ear. I don't know. I do it differently every time just to see, like, what I feel comfortable with. There's not really a necessarily way you, you need to do it. But at the same time, you got to be comfortable with this. So, right now, I'm just making sure the sharp edges um making sure the line in the back matches up all the way with the top of the ear and you can always take your time just make sure that the the trimmer isn't too sharp you could cut people's neck you couldn't but it's I don't, like i said you just gotta make sure they're not too sharp to be cutting anybody As you can see, I'm finished with the back. Now I'm finna start on the, the front hairline. Um, as you can see, just try to I'm prepping it right now, hairspray, then drying it out. Now I'm finna hit it. Um, I start in the middle sometimes. Um, right now this is just for the first video. I wanna see my comfort zone. I'm still trying to find different ways to keep me comfortable, keep me on my toes, but then also learn different ways because you never know how to approach things i'm um, like so there's not a right way but then there's like i said you're not wrong at the same time so any barber that 
if you watch any barbers or like YouTube wise or just in general videos, there's not one right way to do it. At the end of the day, people do get the same result. But at the same time, like I said, it's about comfort. But as you can see right now, I start from the front to go to the, the left, now to the side. And as you can see, I'm just keep hitting it. And so from there, just making sure it says crisp, no pushback or anything. And right now with the C cup, I'm just starting from the top and then going to the bottom and marking my way up back to the top, giving it that Chicago C right there. Shout out to Beam. But as you can see, so. Now I'm just doing the other side. I'm um, starting from the middle and making my way towards the, the right. Just um, really, I mean, you don't gotta keep hitting it a lot, but I do just to make sure I'm giving it a sharp edge up and everything. Um, no pushbacks, um, just make sure that it's still full and lengthy. Even the little baby hairs, I mean, consider, they're not considered, but at the same time, if you're trying to get as crispy as you can without pushing back, that's how you do it. Now, right now, I'm just starting the Chicago C's, starting from the top, then going to the bottom, going back to the top. And right now, I'm just, like I said, this is how I do a hairline, but at the same time, there's, a, there's not a perfect way to do it, it's your comfort. Right now I'm adding uh, a brown pencil, like brown pencil. Um, it kind of is like a concealer. And what you do is just pretty much you add the pencil, not too, not too harsh, um, and you kind of just pretty much blend it out with your trimmer. As you can see, I'm just applying it to just the outer part of his hairline, and I just I'm using my trimmer now just to blend it out. But I mean sometimes if you're if you're trying this new. You gotta have to do a couple times, man, because sometimes the trimmer isn't as sharp. But you have to like, like I said, it's like learning the process because you're not gonna get it the first time. The first time I ever used this, it wasn't like I didn't think it was nice or anything. But at the same time, I had to be confident with it. At the same time, like I said, you do better grow, so. As y'all can see right here, um, I just want to say this is the end result. And this is the new. Hopefully y'all like. Share, comment, man. And like I said, rate my cuts. Let's see. I'll see y'all in the next video. See Blends out.